Hello, my name is Alex. I work as a software engineer at Etsy Microelectronics. In this video, I will be introducing MEM Studio, a cutting-edge software solution that supports a range of sensor-related functionalities. MEM Studio is a powerful new tool that combines existing sensors software tools like Unico, Unicleo, and Algo Builder into a single platform. The software can be used to evaluate sensors, create applications using embedded software libraries designed for MEM sensors, generate code for STM32 microcontrollers, analyze sensor data, and build MLC and FSM based applications. MEM Studio is compatible with a variety of hardware development kits, including the Profim boards, Nucleo board, and Sensor Tile Pro. To get started, we will first connect our Profimums board via USB, and then open MEM Studio. When we open MEM Studio, we must select how we communicate with our board. This can be done using serial bus or Bluetooth, for instance. Then we must choose the correct board or devices is connected to. Once we selected our communication port, MEM Studio recognizes which board is connected and will present a list of possible devices we can connect to our profit memes. To find our device, we can either scroll through the device names, we can search by device types, or we can type in our device name. In this case, I will be using the STEVAL MKI 197v1 that has the sensor LSM6 DSO X sensor. After selecting the correct device, we are then automatically switched to the sensor evaluation tab. From here, we can configure our sensors, such as selecting the scale and audio. But in this tutorial, we'll be using the easy configuration option for quick evaluation. Now, we are able to stream data from the sensor and visualize the output in real time. All we need to do is to hit the play button in the top left corner and select which method to evaluate the sensors, such as bar charts, line charts, and FFT, or fast Fourier transformation. MEM Studio can also be used for evaluating custom libraries through devices, such as the STM32 Nucleo board with the sensor expansion. Using the data log firmware available from Xcube MEMS1 expansion pack on ST.com, we can visualize the orientation of our sensor in real time using sensor fusion. We will now switch back to the Profimus board. And next, under the Advanced Features section, we can access more tools, such as the Pedometer, Finite State Machine, and Machine Learning Core and Embedded Software Libraries. Under the Finite State Machine, we can create or load from any of our existing Finite State Machine a configuration files. To evaluate logic in real time in the testing section. Furthermore, we can debug our finite state machine by injecting previously recorded data logs. The machine learning core has also been made available with all of the same features and capabilities as with the Unico, where we can load data logs, generate ARFF files train and deploy decision trees onto our devices, visualize the output of our decision tree, and debug while injecting previously recorded data logs. In the data analysis tab, we can now load, visualize, labels, and edit data logs offline, all in the same place. And next, Algo Builder has been incorporated in MEM Studio which allows us to build and flash custom algorithm 
using graphical design. Here, I created a simple algorithm that graphs acceleration onto a scatter plot and a line graph. And finally, we can flash any device using the firmware programming section. Here, I flash our performance using the evaluation software for MemStudio. Thanks for watching. For more information on MemStudio, please visit sc.com/mems. Have a great day.